you've got to mention the cream Armani suits, John. Armani said cream rather than white because <laughs> it's a little bit better, not much better. <laughs> it's a bit better. David James used to model for Armani. And of course, then, listen, I said, let's get a nice blue Armani suit. Right. Nice. Because if I had a blue Armani suit, I could be wearing it now. Let it out a bit to make double XL instead of slim fit. <laughs> but once David James is modeling, and he's a model, and Armani, and of course, this is a period of time now where super p- football players, football players who were superstars in my day, their superstardom got them into the red line to get pissed all night till six o'clock in the morning. That's how superstars acted. That's what makes you a superstar. Superstars, once the Premier League started, was about glamour and glitz and, and, and string fellas and nightlife and showing off and stuff like that. So, of course, then they thought the cream suits, Wembley would have looked nice. So I got on voted on that, as much as I was the captain, so I got on a lot of the stick. But I can safely say it was J- David James and a few of the other Spice Boys who wanted to think they'll look cool in the cream suits. Now, <laughs> this is where football is interesting because had we won that cup final, we would have been cool. Yeah. But when you lose the cup final, you look like a bunch of idiots, don't you? So <laughs> that's what I mean. It doesn't matter what you do, what you wear, what you say, if you're a win, if you're winning and you're successful, when Cantona spoke about trawlers and seagulls, because he was Cantona, great player, he, he's a philosopher. If it was Tony Adams, the old Tony Adams alcoholic, talked rubbish about seagulls yeah. and trawlers, then I said he's an idiot and he's cut me accent. Yeah. <laughs> so the cream suit was really down to the fact that we we um we lost the game. <laughs>